Yo, so how's it going guys? Welcome back to another GTA 5 video. So as I'm sure you guys were all aware, last month Rockstar Games went ahead and released a brand new Kyle Perico Island, which of course is the first ever map expansion in GTA 5 Online in the 7 year tenure of the game. Now before Kyle Perico was a thing, the majority of the community believed that Rockstar Games would end up releasing North Yankton into GTA 5 Online. If you guys aren't aware, during the story mode in GTA 5, the pro log mission the very first mission you guys actually take part in actually takes part in a different location to los santos and blaine county as i'm sure the majority of you guys are aware it actually takes part in north yankton which is completely separate to the main map in gta 5 online now there has been tons of different glitches over the years that would allow us to go ahead and explore north yankton which we cannot do in single player if you guys aren't aware when you're taking part in the very first prologue mission if you guys try to drive too far away out of the mission it will just fail the mission and you guys will get reset and rockstar games always are very very quick to patch any glitches that would allow us to go ahead and access north yankton however in today's video i've got an absolutely epic 100 percent solo method that will allow all of you guys to go ahead and explore north yankton with your gta 5 online character which i know a ton of you guys have been calling out for me to post over the last few years so as always if you guys do enjoy this video and you would like to see me cover more glitches like this in the future for example if rockstar games end up patching this method if i do see this video does do well i'll be sure to post a brand new method straight away so if this is something that you guys would like to see on my channel more often do be sure to show support with a like down below and if you guys are new around here feel free to subscribe as i do post daily gta 5 videos without further ado let's get into the video okay so the very first step we're going to take will actually depend on your aim preference because what you guys want to do is basically switch the aim preferences to what you guys typically play in so for example like myself if the majority of you and your friends play on assisted aim the first step you guys want to do is load into single player you want to press start and you want to go ahead and change the aiming to free aim so you basically want to do the opposite of what you guys usually play in the reason for this is because we want to join in someone else's session later on in the video that plays on a different aim preference to us but like i said me personally i play on assisted aim i know the majority of my friends also play on assisted aim so when i go ahead and join their session later on in the video i will get prompted with an alert message which we do want to get i don't worry we don't actually need our friend to help us this is 100 percent solo i just used a bunch of people for my crew without them even knowing so like i said the very first step you guys want to do is be in a single player session and you just want to set your target and mode to free aim now once you guys have set your target and mode to free aim you simply want to go ahead press start and launch a brand new game i'm not going to cut any of this video i will fast forward in certain parts but i don't want to cut any of it just to prove that this is 100 100% working as of right now okay so once you guys log into north yankton the prologue as you guys can see you simply just want to press start and go ahead and load up the creator mode now once you guys load into the creator mode you want to scroll all the way down to exit gta 5 online now this is where you have to be quite quick with this glitch as soon as you guys press exit you want to accept the first message once you guys accept the alert message go ahead and join your friend who plays in a different aim preference to you but when the alerts pop up you want to accept the first one and decline the second one very quickly and to know that you guys done it right you should see michael glitched out in the background in the sky now, once michael's glitched out in the sky as you guys can see on screen simply press start and go ahead and load up rockstar editor now once you guys load up rockstar editor you want to simply go ahead and select director mode now once you guys load into director mode just simply go ahead and exit it to story now you guys should notice it will load you guys back into the prologue mission for this part you guys will have to be pretty quick and it might take you guys a few tries what you guys simply want to do is when the cutscene is playing press start go across the online 
you want to select play GTA 5 online go to an invite only session you want to accept this first message and quickly join your friend who plays in a different aim preference and once you guys join your friend session you want to quickly spam down a on the xbox or x on the playstation so we're quickly accepting all of the invites and you guys will notice if done correctly michael will be glitched out right next to this trash can or dumpster so once michael is glitched out exactly like you guys can see on screen go ahead press start and we want to go ahead and launch the rockstar editor now once rockstar editor loads up simply go down and launch director mode and from here the glitch is basically done all you guys simply have to go ahead and do is select the character that you want to use to go ahead and explore north yankton in you can choose from a bunch of characters as you guys can see on screen if you do want to try something different but if you guys just want to be like myself you can also go ahead and select your online characters so simply go ahead select your online character and then bang you guys will notice you'll be glitched straight into north yankton just like that now the good thing about this glitch is you can actually pull up your interaction menu and enable a bunch of different mods like invincibility explosive bullets you can even change your wanted level so you guys can go ahead and steal a cop card to explore north yankton to the fullest now the mass majority of this map where you guys can actually see stuff like building science you will be able to explore fully however if you guys do go to far out of the map then you will end up falling through it so just be careful you can kind of see the textures once they kind of pixelate just like you guys can see on screen you do want to avoid that because you will fall through the map however like i said from here you guys are 100 free to go ahead and explore north yankton to the fullest i know a lot of you guys have been waiting for this glitch on my channel for years so this one's for you guys kicking off the brand new year in style and like i said if you guys do need to get a vehicle to go ahead and explore the map just go ahead and set yourself a wanted level steal a cop car and remove your wanted level as easy as that now there is a few different landmarks in north yankton that you can go ahead and explore so i'm going to play out some music for the rest of the video while i just show off some of the different landmarks that you guys can go ahead and visit as always if you guys have enjoyed this video and you would like to see me post more glitches and tricks like this in the future all i ask is you take two seconds to return the favor by dropping a like down below and if you guys are new around here feel free to subscribe with notifications turned on as i do post daily gta 5 videos thanks a lot for watching guys and i'll see you in my next video peace